Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I'm here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Tauruses watching. So if you have Taurus as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this reading might resonate or apply to you. So Taurus, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get started with your reading, Taurus, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Taurus, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Alright, Taurus, so let's go ahead and get into your reading. Let's check in on this person who's coming towards you, how they feel about you. And let's get some overall messages regarding the connection you're in currently. Can we please get a few cards for Taurus? A few specific messages for Taurus. Who's this person that Taurus is dealing with at the moment? Okay, Taurus, we have two cards that came out. Let me get my cards together. All right, can we please get a few more specific messages? How does this person truly feel towards Taurus and what do they want for Taurus to know, please? Let's go ahead and get a few more cards, please, for Taurus. Okay. Let's go ahead and just get one more specific message, one or two more specific messages for Taurus, please. How else does this person feel towards Taurus and what do they want for Taurus to know? Okay, Taurus, so we'll start with these cards that we do have. Before I do show them and get into them, please keep in mind that any energy, feelings, emotions, actions that I'm describing from your person, Taurus, that could be how you feel. The roles could be reversed. Just however this reading resonates for you, please only take what resonates out of it. So the first card that did come out, Taurus, I miss you. I'm scared to come back to this. What if it's comfort? I know where we stand, so don't worry. What happened to all those plans you had for us? I've worked hard on us, but I also know my worth. We have the future ahead of us. Don't worry about the past. And I've never seen someone put together so perfectly. So Taurus, um, we do have some, some energy of separation, being at a distance from this person. I feel like you and this person were once close together, Taurus, like doing everything together, talking all the time. Your plans included them, their plans included, their plans included you, Taurus. It's like being with somebody through the ups and downs and like putting so much love into a person that even when you two are in separation or not on the best of terms, there's always this this thought of knowing that you and this person are not finished like there's still there's still something yet to come between you two but I feel like you and this person are in at a distance or separated at this time because I feel like somewhere throughout this Taurus you just weren't getting everything that you wanted maybe when you and this person first got together you love them for the person that they were, but then again, the, the bar wasn't raised so high. And I'll try to explain that a little bit better. It's, it's like maybe you were accepting less from this person out of love. And then as this connection started to pick up, maybe you felt, Taurus, that they weren't giving you everything that 
that you deserved when it came to love. They may have slacked off or they may have, I feel like there's this energy of somebody not being so motivated compared to you, Taurus. Like you had all these plans for yourself um, to, to ascend into the highest version of yourself. And maybe this person wasn't seeing that for themselves individually. And we could try to motivate that person if that is the case. Um, but when we, when we make it our job or more of our priority to help this person see the bigger and different parts and areas of life, it can drain us. So I, I feel like there is this energy of somebody leeching off of you, Taurus, and like you not getting what you wanted out of this person, out of this connection in the moment. And maybe you didn't expect it right away, but if you and this person were knowing one another for a while, it's like, when is this going to happen? This could also come out as this person just not ready to make the next steps with you, Taurus. But I feel like you had, you Taurus, you had or have like a bigger vision of yourself, like the person you end up with, love, like, yeah, you, you have this grand vision and it's not impossible at all to achieve but maybe this person wasn't a part of that like they weren't meeting what needed to be met to be a part of that Taurus so maybe you two separated because both of you two had some learning and growing to do individually if it did end up like that Taurus I feel like you were the one trying to separate from this person remember roles could be reversed but i feel like you were the one to try and separate or distance yourself from this person so that they could see things for themselves and you could see things for yourself taurus it's not like you wanted to leave this person but i feel like after some time it may have got draining with this person it may have felt like you were stuck taurus but you weren't stuck and it's like once this ended or the separation happened, <coughs> excuse me, the separation happened, I feel like there was some relief on your end, but because of all the love that you have or had for this person, um, and I'll go ahead and get into the cards, but because of all the love that you had for this person, Taurus, you still kept them in, in your mind, in your future. And it's like there's this energy of this person wanting to reconvene this connection. But let's go ahead and get into these cards, Taurus. We have, I miss you. I feel like this is this person's energy. Could be a mutual energy, but this person missing your love from afar. Wanting that connection, that close connection that you two once had. I don't feel like you were trying to leave this person out in the cold, but with the I've worked hard on us, but I also know my worth, it, it's what needed to be done to perhaps save yourself, Taurus, for you not to be pulled into any negative energy that you were experiencing or feeling. Could have also been some codependency here. Say this person wasn't, I'm going to use this word caliber as you, Taurus, not saying that you're better than this person, but I feel like you already had a firmer idea of what you want for yourself and this person wasn't they were either slowing you down or they were not meeting the criteria so this person may have tried to hold on to you Taurus maybe they even brought you into some low vibrational things or an, a mindset and attitude we have I'm scared to come back to this what if it's comfort I feel like this is your energy Taurus realizing or recognizing the love that you have for this person or that you did have for this person and knowing that like within love there's so many different aspects that fall into it so wanting to love this person for the right reasons and not just solely out of comfort because you know that that could bring you into a headspace or an environment that you don't want for yourself we also have what happened to all those plans you had for us? I feel like this is a mutual energy here, Taurus. For you, Taurus, while you were in this connection with this person, they were maybe stalling or slacking or you didn't see so much growth on their end. This person may have also wanted to do everything with you, Taurus, and 
it may have became a problem over time, like give me my space so I could be okay to interact with you in this connection. Like don't cloud my energy. Don't be so much overbearing. Um, but I also feel like this is your person's energy towards a thought that throughout whatever you two are going to be close to one another. So they kind of feel like the Five of Pentacles energy being left out in the cold. We have, I know where we stand, so don't worry. I feel like this is a mutual energy here, Taurus, just that love that you two have for one another, bringing you two back together. Maybe this is just a period of space between you two. Like we both need to work on ourselves or you need to work on this. I need to work on that so we could fulfill this or fill this to the fullest, Taurus. We have we have the future ahead of us. Don't worry about the past. But this person coming back, Taurus, maybe they have changed. Maybe they have improved or worked on some of the things that you weren't the most happiest with. So... It's understandable that you, Taurus, you might be concerned if this person is going to bring that same energy like they once did before, but it's like they want you to put that behind you, or the both of you. I've never seen someone put together so perfectly. This is how your person feels about you, Taurus. They, they feel nurtured very much, like Queen of Pentacles energy, like you're also the Empress, um, but they feel like they're taken care of like you're you're beautiful Taurus like you can do no wrong and this is why they miss you so much because they don't want you Taurus to slip out of their hands or even if you've already did and this connection is at a distance like it'll take more than a talk to reconcile with one another it's like they don't want to lose or miss the opportunity of having you in their future because of everything that they do see in you let's go ahead and get a few more specific messages for Taurus about this energy that we do have what else is Taurus need to know about this person what other energy is this person bringing towards Taurus please and how do they truly feel let's go ahead and get one more card We'll actually get one more specific message for Taurus, please. What else does Taurus need to know? Okay, Taurus. So we'll leave it at those last few cards we have. My actions may change, but how I feel towards you stays the same. I know I'm confusing. I'm still figuring myself out. We also have Twin Flame and... You make me a better person. So Taurus, um, yeah, the twin flame came out very, very well could be a twin flame connection. You two find, find a way back to one another because of the love that you have for one another. But there's been some lessons that this other person is hasn't yet experienced. So it may take them to experience things for themselves to be fully ready for this connection to work. We have, I know I'm confusing, I'm still figuring myself out. I feel like this might be your person's energy. Um, them, like that slacking energy I was talking about, Taurus. This could also be your energy, Taurus. Maybe this person has made you reconsider your, like what you're looking for exactly. Because I feel like with this person, Taurus, you had a lot of love for them, or you still do. But maybe what they showed you over time made you rethink things about them. My actions may change, but how I feel towards you stays the same. I, I also feel like this might be a mutual energy in the way that you two might be distant from one another, not talking at the moment, but the emotions are still there. Like the feelings are known from afar and you make me a better person. I feel like this is your person's message to you, Taurus. The energy that you radiate, maybe you try to help this person, but you realize that you can only help them so much. But they take that in, Taurus, and they appreciate you. Let's see what sign you might be dealing with. Can we please get a sign for Taurus, please? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Taurus came out. Could be dealing with the Pisces, does not have to resonate. 
Taurus again. So maybe even a Taurus. Let's go ahead and get another sign for Taurus. Libra. What sign might Taurus be dealing with, please? Aries. Let's go ahead and get one more sign for Taurus, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And Leo. Scorpio and Aquarius might be relevant as well, Taurus, but I will go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.